Hi, in this video we are going to see hollow cathode lamp used in atomic absorption spectrometer as a radiation source. This is a hollow cathode lamp for uh, uh, element magnesium and in this hollow cathode lamp uh, there is a tungsten anode and a cylindrical hollow cathode okay this is the tungsten anode and this is the cylindrical hollow cathode okay this hollow cathode is uh, made of element to be determined so here the element is magnesium so the ho hollow cathode is made of magnesium and these are sealed in a glass tube filled with an inert gas that is uh, neon or argon at a pressure of between 1 newton per meter square and 5 newton per meter square this is the terminals for electrical connections the ionization of some gas atoms occurs by applying a potential difference of about 300 to 400 volt between the anode and the cathode between the anode and the cathode these gaseous ions bombard the cathode and eject bombard the cathode and eject metal atoms from the cathode in a process called sputtering some sputtered atoms are in excited states and emit radiation characteristic of the metal as they fall back to the ground state the shape of the cathode concentrates the radiation into a beam which passes through a quartz window and the shape of the lamp is such that most of the sputtered atoms are deposited redeposited on the cathode this is a hollow cathode lamp milliampere hour meter this meter measures the number of milliampere hours that your lamp has operated the range of meter is from 0 to 10,000 milliampere hours. This information will assist you in determining when to replace a lamp. That's all. Thanks for watching this video.